Hey guys, you got quarantined Lippy here. How we doing? Okay, so today we're gonna be playing with our hair because you know what else do you do when you are quarantined up? Um, okay, I would just like to side note this and say I was not planning on doing anything to my hair. I was gonna get my hair cut and colored like normal before all of this went down. And now that I have free time and I can't get my hair done, why not just go about it? you know, in our own way. We're just going to put rose gold in it. We have the Moroccan oil color depositing hair mask in rose gold. You guys have seen me use this product, this brand on my channel before. They haven't sponsored me. I just kind of trust it. But if they ever want to sponsor me, hit me up and we can do another color. You know what I'm saying? But today it is going to be rose gold. I thought it'd be fun to kind of see what mess we get ourselves into like I usually do. Um, this is the natural state. I feel so sorry for my hairstylist because I was trying to strip it from like everything. I just kind of wanted it to be its natural whatever. So whenever she bleached it, she wasn't like digging through colors, but um, she might be digging through rose gold later. You know what I'm saying? But this is what it looks like. No toners, no purple shampoos. Literally nothing has been in it since the blue, since the blue shampoo. If you've seen it, Great, if you haven't, I'll leave it in the description bar below. You can kind of see when I turn my hair bluey gray. Love that color, so I wanted to see what else I could do with it. So, um, I don't know, I'm just talking a lot. I, let's, let's just dive into it. Step one, comb the hair. <clears throat> Wow, doesn't it look soft now or unhealthy? Probably both, okay? We're just gonna we're just gonna put this all over our hair. So we have two packets just in case. I'm hoping I only need to use one, but let's let's just see what happens. I'm also gonna be trying to make a TikTok while I film this, so wish me luck. Ooh, are we ready? We are ready. Just gonna open this up. This is so much more pink than I thought. I'm sitting on a towel. Don't worry. Fuck. Ah. Well, that wasn't supposed to happen. Part two. Okay, we're just gonna, yeah. The fact that this is supposed to be rose gold, should I be worried? Probably. Can you see the pink? You'd think by now, that I would learn to maybe separate my hair. Nah, but basically you put this on dry hair. It's supposed to be dry, clean hair. I washed my hair like two days ago, so it's like clean enough. Um, we just love rules here. The one thing that I don't like about this product is like the smell is always so freaking strong and I'm not like, like I'm not like, oh, I hate the smell, but I'm not like, mm, I wanna smell that smell. You know what I mean? It's just very like synthetic. What I like about this product is it is supposed to be kind of conditioning, I think. It's like a, from my understanding, a deep conditioner. Okay, so here we are. It's been about 10 minutes of letting this sit in my hair, honestly. This pink is a lot darker than I thought it would be, so maybe it's gonna come out not rose gold. We will see. Um, so what I'm gonna do is go take a shower and we can just, we can just look at it together. Okay, so I didn't wanna leave you guys hanging too much. I kinda wanted to show you what it looked like as soon as I got out of the shower. So honestly, it's a darker pink than I kind of expected. You can kind of see the light catching it. And if I get really close, you can kind of see the dimension in the color. I do, yeah, this is it more accurate. You can kind of see it's like this pinky, almost like a purpley reddish color, like a burgundy. So I'm kind of curious to see what it looks like once it actually dries and once I like style it. But it looks darker than what I was kind of going for. But to be fair, I started out with dark blondish hair. So whatever happens, happens. I've had color like dark purple before and it wasn't really the look I was going for. So curious to see what happens. I wanted a light pink. It doesn't look like a light pink, but maybe when it washes out, like after washing it a few times, it turns into light pink. And so <laughs> let's see what it looks like tomorrow. We're just gonna leave it here. We're gonna let it air dry. And then let's just, let's just see what it looks like. Okay, so see you, see you in just a second. 
update on update so after five minutes of ending that clip i kind of looked in the mirror and i was like whoa my hair is kind of like purpley pinky looking it's just just a little too much okay it's not what we're going for and so then i decided to get in the shower again like i typically do and you know when in doubt just shampoo it out okay and so then i just shampooed it and now hopefully it is a much lighter muted pink it looks like it doesn't look as intense and i was kind of looking for something a little bit more subtle <laughs> so hopefully this makes it look good you can definitely pick up on the tint of it hello sun pick up on it you can kind of see how it looks like that pinky reddish color but it's still like not rose gold like i was expecting it to be so let's just kind of see what this looks like tomorrow when everything's nice and dry but um <laughs> Just wanted to update and update y'all because that's what we do here, figuring it out together. Okay, now we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so I am in a different location. This is what my hair looks like the next day. If I'm being honest, it is a lot darker than I thought it'd be. I was kind of hoping for like a very light cotton candy pink, and this is just this is just a darker pink than I was expecting. And it might have been because my hair is a dark blonde underneath and not a light blonde for it to you know cling to but I haven't styled it so I'm gonna go ahead and curl it and I'm gonna probably try to film a little bit of that and then I will show you like how it looks like completely after it's all done but okay let's let's just let's just style it side note I'm looking in the mirror for this but I freaking love this curling iron this is the Duval um it has three barrels so it has one two and grab the other one three so they're detachable and they come in different sizes i'm using the largest one but i will put a link to this in the description down below because i use this like every single time i curl my hair now addicted to it and so use this and now what i'm going to do is take the ends of my hair and kind of straighten them out with my straightening iron and this is the one i've been using forever it's a g ghd can't even talk ghd one so i'm going to go ahead and straighten the bottoms of it so <laughs> let's do it and here are the end results okay anytime I style my hair it's automatically gonna look better but this is what it looks like if I'm being 100% honest with you guys I wish it was a bit lighter but that may have to do with a couple factors one I don't follow directions and I definitely left this on more than five to seven minutes haha <laughs> and two I have really dark roots right now so this color kind of makes everything look a bit darker because I have black here and then like this darker pink I think this would be a beautiful color during the fall because I've done it. I've done it every single year. I've always ended up putting purple or pink in my hair. It's just like not that, is it me? Like that rose gold you're looking for? To me, this is more of like a burgundy color. Maybe I'm crazy, so let me know in the comments down below. I definitely think that once I wash this a couple times, it's gonna get to the color I want it to get to. But originally, if I'm like going for a specific color, it's, it's just not there yet. But like, I think it might be my fault. In general, I do think it looks really pretty and I think it's light and the sun kind of gives it some dimension and it's fun to do while sitting at home. But is this my favorite color I've ever done? No, I've done other colors. But I think with my videos, if you guys keep watching, you will see the progression of the color because each week I post a video, so each week I am washing my hair. So I always make a joke that my hair is a different color every, <laughs> every video I make. But I mean, I think it looks great. I think the product works. I would just expect it to be a little bit darker than that rose gold and again, probably left in the product just, just a tad bit longer but this is what it looks like so let me know what you guys think in the comments down below let me know if you want me to try out a different color hopefully my hairdresser does not kill me this kind of needs to come out in about um, a month a month and a half so wish me luck I feel like this product kind of typically stays in your hair for a while or the blue one did so I don't know about this one but you know <laughs> okay so until next time I will see you then make sure you hit that subscribe button hit that like button hit that bell icon notification button every time I post you will be notified okay until next time be safe stay inside quarantine it up dye your hair because bad influence bye guys <laughs>